Hello from Slovenia again. <clears throat> uh, today it's a flower, reverse flower deep day. And uh, I want to thank you all the, of my viewers that I almost consider friends <clears throat> for sending me paints and all the other stuff I got a really nice package from Carol Cheryl Carol last uh, month and um, Mel sent me some extreme sheen 24 karat gold and this metallic cobalt blue from Artist Loft and I really I'm really excited to try this and I will do just uh, one simple flower just to see I mix all my paints with my pouring medium and I will use some Amsterdam greenish blue and decor 24 karat gold and artist loft metallic cobalt blue <clears throat> and just titanium white Amsterdam titanium white so no pearl white I will start with this greenish blue and gold next And let's do white and white as I said this is just titanium white it's not my pearl white mixture and cobalt metallic cobalt and I will go again with this greenish blue Amsterdam and gold extreme sheen gold 24 karat gold <laughs> and metallic cobalt and white and I forgot I should have done white first but now it is what it is Oops, a drip. Hmm, I will just do a little of this gold again and cobalt metallic again, and then I will turn my copper and do one layer more. My skewer to do petals, and I was not a lot of. Uh, I wasn't so active on my YouTube and social medias lately because we renovated our bathroom and it's finally done but now you know what is next a lot of cleaning so I'm quite busy with this and I have to send out my paintings so gold hope that this will not react too much and white and metallic cobalt and this will be it because I kind of like a little more negative space I don't think that this 
flowers necessarily should be all over the uh, the canvas so we will see I don't know just drag this I'm really curious how this will work and I have quite a lot of different paints too to try so definitely will I will spray my paper napkin with water not too much just to soften it down and place it down carefully I can't buy paper napkins that I normally use but I think that this one is similar so let's give it a try Okay. And I have my canvas on spinner, so I definitely can spin it a little bit if I will think that it's not big enough. <laughs> but uh, it grows a little bit because of all this uh, if I use um, pearl white it tends to grow and uh, probably this extreme sheen too so even if it will not be really big I hope that it will grow a little bit to leave this wow I like it just have a white drip here so I will just add oof. And I will not um, spin it and stretch it because this time I want to have this flower a little with a little more negative space. Maybe just one baby spin, but not too much. But. I definitely get lacing I obviously didn't do perfect job with lifting because you see here but I really want to leave it like um, a little smaller not stretch it out too much with a little more negative space I will just try to bring this a little towards the middle to fix this middle okay I will leave it like it is because I like it so take you down for a close-up So you can see the lacing with this gold and I like the center, I really do. So this is the part that I didn't lift my uh, napkin as good as on other parts. 
But we know already nothing is perfect. So can't wait to see how this metallic cobalt will dry because this is the first time that I use it and I really think that it's kind of neat even if that is it is um, small but sometimes you know it's okay to have just uh, a small flower on the canvas it doesn't it doesn't need to be all over you can have some negative space uh, I will add some black around afterwards to flatten it down and it will you know spread just a little more but hopefully not too much and because I don't like when they go over the edge in the way that I don't know so this is it for today and see you on the next one bye